Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get each fish, uh, where the location is, what fishing pole you have to use, what time of day it has to be. As of right now, nobody's caught number one. We don't know how to get it. I'm about to do another video that I have some good ideas on how to possibly capture that. If you guys want to subscribe and check out my next video, uh, it's going to be searching for that by with unique methods that I'm not going to reveal in this video. Uh, so the orange flopper we have, um, you can find this one easy anywhere, no problem there. Um, Green flopper, you can find it anywhere. Blue flopper, anywhere. Blue slurp fish, anywhere. Yellow slurp fish has to be found in swamp areas. It can be day or night. You can use uh, any kind of fishing pole. It doesn't matter. Um, the purple slurp fish is in mountainous areas. You need to be in mountainous areas for that. Uh, let's see. Uh, mountainous areas, I would recommend maybe over right here. Possibly in this area. Or over here. These are some mountainous areas all around here. For the black slurpfish, it's found near coastal areas at night. So it needs to be nighttime. Uh, you guys can do this in Battle Lab. Go into Battle Lab and you can fish to your heart's content. You can catch every fish in Battle Lab. It doesn't go towards your challenges. It does go towards your uh, ranking and your scores and stuff. So for the white slurpfish, the white slurfish requires a pro fishing rod. You do need a pro fishing rod. You can take any fishing rod and you can upgrade it at a workbench for 100 mats each. Um, this one's found in swamp areas at night. To get the white slurfish, you have to go to the swamp area at night. So obviously, slurpy swamp at nighttime. Um, you could probably do it near the uh, Fortilla too. This is basically a swamp area. Uh, the next we have the drift spicy fish. Uh, let's see. You can find that in forest areas. Forest areas is going to be Weeping Woods. The river all along Weeping Woods, you can find that fish. Uh, the white spotted spicy fish, you can find that in mountainous areas. Um, the southern spicy fish, you can find in swamp areas. The sky blue spicy fish, you can find in coastal areas. Coastal areas are going to be obviously around the coast along the outside of the map on the ocean where the beaches are and where the side of the mountains are. Um, you can find all those coastal area fish there. Uh, the molten spicy fish is easy to find. You can find it anywhere. The drift hop flopper. You can find that one anywhere with a regular fishing pole. The coho hop flopper, number 16, you can find that in forest areas. Once again, near Weeping Woods is a good area for that one. The Atlantic hop flopper is number 17. You need a pro fishing rod to find that one. Number 18 we have the chin hook hop flopper. Um, you can find that one in swamp areas. The chum hop flopper. You can find that one in coastal areas. The slurp jellyfish. You can find that one anywhere. That one's pretty uh, common. This one took me a while to find guys. My best recommendation for finding number 21 the dark vanguard jellyfish is to go to slurpy swamp. It says it's found at night. And it doesn't say where so basically it makes you think you can find it anywhere uh, but me and my friend we found a bunch of those at slurpee we couldn't find it anywhere else if you're having trouble finding this one go to slurpee at night once again you can go to battle lab you can choose what time of day you want it to be you can choose it to be day or night you can choose night and go find those fish anywhere there's no fish that need to be found during the day so you can just put it on night and find all the fish if this is your goal uh, the cuddle jellyfish is actually not too rare uh, it's found in swamp areas. You don't need a regular, you don't need a pro fishing pole for that one. Uh, the Peely Jellyfish. I found three of those. You do need a pro fishing rod and it's found in mountainous areas. I found mine near uh, Misty. Okay, for the next we have the Purple Jellyfish. Uh, it's found in coastal areas. Easy one to do. The Black and Blue Shieldfish. It's number 25. You can find that one anywhere. The Black Striped Shieldfish, number 26. You can find that in coastal areas. Number 27, we have the pink shield fish. You can find that one anywhere, but you need a pro fishing rod to get that one. The green shield fish is found in forest areas. The light blue shield fish can be found anywhere. The green thermal fish at number 30 can be found in forest areas, weeping woods. All right, the silver thermal fish can be found anywhere, but you need a pro fishing rod. The raven thermal fish can be found in the coastal areas with a pro fishing rod. The red and green thermal fish can be found in the forest areas and you do not need a pro fishing rod. You can find that with a regular rod. 
The purple and orange thermal fish can be found anywhere with a regular rod. See the small fries, the only way to get small fries is to not be fishing at a fishing spot. You actually have to be out in the water. Uh, we got the light blue small fry that can be found anywhere. The tan small fry can be found anywhere. The purple top small fry can be found anywhere. And the black small fry can be found anywhere, but it has to be at night. All right, guys, that was all the fish. Uh, if you guys appreciate this video, then please like and subscribe. I've got some more videos on the Midas fish coming out. So make sure you're subscribed for those videos. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you for being here.